Hmm. Table looks fine. Now, where are the cigars? Oh, here. Mm hmm. I guess he'll fall for this layout, all right. Hello, Daddy. Oh, hello, Snooks. Oh, uh, let's have a look at you. Why did I have to put on my new dress, Daddy? Because my boss is coming for dinner. Why? Right. Well, uh, well, we don't have guests very often, and it's good to make social contacts and fraternize with intellectual people. My boss is a very smart man, and I like to listen to his conversation. You understand? Uh huh. You're trying to get a raise. <laughs> Nothing of the kind. And I don't want you making any cracks when he gets here either. I won't, Daddy. Above all, don't say anything about his hair. Why? Just don't, that's all. What's the matter with his hair? Nothing. I'm just warning you not to make any remarks about it. All right. And listen, Snooks. You're not to come into the dining room while we're having dinner. Not even if my boss asks you to. Why? Never mind why. All I want you to do is greet Mr. Gordon and then run upstairs and play. All right. And now we'd better have a little rehearsal. I'll be Mr. Gordon. Who is he? My boss. I'll be my boss. Huh? I said I'm Mr. Gordon. No, you ain't. You're my daddy. We're just pretending. I want to make sure you'll behave nicely when Mr. Gordon comes. Now, I'm Mr. Gordon, and I'm coming in. <coughs> oh, good evening, Snooks. Hello, daddy. No, no. Say good evening to Mr. Gordon. Where is he? He's not here yet. Now, why should I say good evening to him? You're not saying it to him, you're saying it to me. Right now, I'm Mr. Gordon, even though I'm still your daddy. And while Mr. Gordon isn't even here yet, you can say good evening to him because you're really saying it to me. And don't ask me if I feel all right. Why? Now, don't you start to irritate me, Snooks. And another thing, in case Mr. Gordon asks you to come into dinner, I want you to say no thanks. I've already eaten. Now, let's try it. All right. Now, here we go. Where are we going? Nowhere! Ah. Now, let's try it. Talk. Good evening, Snooks. No, thank you. I've already eaten. Say good evening first. Why? Because you've got to greet him. Now, let's try it again. <clears throat> good evening, Snooks. Good evening, Mr. Gordon. Fine. Oh, uh, Snooks, <laughs> will you come in and eat with us? Uh-huh. No, I told you to say you'd already eaten. I'm still hungry. Just the same, you've got to say I've already eaten. Huh? Say I've already eaten. Good evening, Snooks. Will you eat with us? Daddy's already eaten. But I'm hungry. No, no, no. Snooks, I, I don't want to lose my temper with you. When he asked you to come in and eat, just... A... Oh, there he is now. Now, remember, Snooks. All right. Oh, well, come right in, Mr. Gordon. Yeah. Nice place he was. There he is. Oh, is this baby Snooks? Yes, sir, Mr. Gordon. Shake hands with Mr. Gordon, Snooks. What a cute child. Uh, dinner's all ready. Okay. Uh, oh, Snooks, will you have a bite with us? Snooks. I say, will you have a bite with us? No, thanks. I've already bitten. <laughs> well, uh, run along upstairs and play, Snooks. Uh, this way, Mr. Gordon. Daddy. Yes? Why did he tell me not to say anything about his hair? What's that? He ain't got any. <laughs> well, you think that's funny, young lady? Uh-huh. He'll look like my Aunt Chloe. <laughs> oh, Oh, uh, pay no attention to Mr. Gordon. <laughs> She's a great little clown. <laughs> <laughs> what are you yelling about? I don't know. Uh, let her come in and sit with us while we eat, Higgins. Oh, no, she has to uh, do her homework. Uh, don't you, Snooksy? No, I don't. Oh, all right, come on. Uh, sit here, Mr. Gordon, and Snooks, you sit by me. No, I don't want to. Well, why not? I want to sit near Mr. Gordon and watch him do some tricks. Tricks? Uh, what tricks? I wish I was dead. Will you have some water, Mr. Gordon? Uh, no, thank you. Ah! Well, what's the matter? Make him swallow the water, Daddy. Well, why do you want to see me swallow water? Because Daddy says you drink like a fish. <laughs> oh, she made that up. She made it up, so help me, Mr. Gordon. I never said anything of the kind. You go upstairs this minute, you little scamp. If he takes me out, I'll spill the soup on Mr. Gordon. <laughs> well, I, I must say, Higgins, uh, this little daughter of yours makes eating here a pleasure. You like it, Mr. Gordon? Uh, no, he doesn't like it. Mr. Gordon wants you to leave the room so he can eat in peace. What are you doing? One penny fell under the table. Be careful, Snooks. You're pulling the table. Uh, hey, look out. Snooks, the whole thing's going to... Oh, oh. I think I'll go now. Oh, there's the whole dinner. I wasn't very hungry anyhow. I think I'll go to... Oh, now, just a minute, Mr. Gordon. Uh, please don't leave. We might be able to straighten this out. I... Give him some pie, Daddy. Hmm? Oh, yeah, yes. How about a piece of green apple pie, hmm? Mm -hmm. Here, uh, look at it. Oh, you'll love it. Well, well <laughs> all right. Uh, have you a little piece of cheese to go with it? A cheese? Oh, 
Oh, I'm awfully sorry, Mr. Gordon. There isn't a piece of cheese in the house. Yes, there is, Daddy. I'll go get it. Oh, fine. Phew. I'm terribly sorry about this. That's all right. The uh, child didn't mean it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah sure. Here's the cheese, Mr. Gordon. Oh, thanks, Nut. Mmm. Yeah. That's good, too. <laughs> Eat it all. Oh, yes. Well, well. Mm. well you well, know, that, that's funny. I, I distinctly remember Mother saying we were out of cheese. Mm, this is great. <clears throat> well, I guess you've got sharper eyes than your daddy, eh, Snooks? Uh-huh. Uh, where did you find that cheese, Snooks? 